beginning Sunday evening, there's going to be one of my favorite celestial phenomena, and that's a lunar eclipse. And the thing that's so wonderful about these is that they are incredibly easy to see. All you need to do is go outside. You don't need any sort of special viewing equipment. And so what's going to happen is that on Sunday night, the moon is actually going to move into the shadow of the Earth. And everything needs to be perfectly lined up for that. That doesn't happen every month. It always happens when we have a full moon, which means that the sun and the moon are on opposite sides of the Earth. The Earth's in the middle and the Earth will be casting its shadow onto the moon. And so if you're in the uh, the eastern uh, part of North America, uh, that's going to begin at about 10 p.m. And uh, the peak of it will be a little bit after midnight on the east coast of the United States. Now, the thing that's kind of wonderful about this particular lunar eclipse is that it's actually viewable over much of the world. It's, it's actually wonderfully positioned. So uh, if you're in South America, you'll be able to see the entire eclipse, including the wonderful part of totality. And, uh, and then if you're in North America, about half of it will see the whole eclipse. But all the way from New Zealand, we'll see a partial eclipse all the way through to uh, some parts of Eastern Europe. So a lot of people on the planet have a chance to see this eclipse in one form or another.